Okay, hello. So um, I'm doing a house tour today. Oh, I don't know where to look, but um, we've moved in for a few weeks now, and it just feels like a lot of things are packed away. So this is probably a good time to show off the place, and everyone can get a good like first look. So I I went to the bedroom first. That seems it seems to make more sense to start outside, and then go in. So. I'll just, I might not say much where I'm at here, there might be neighbours about. But um, we've got the original uh, kookaburra door, which I'm very happy about. Let's have a look. We're gonna get this fence repainted and fixed. It's very windy today. Okay, so, um, so that's a lovely outside that, like I said, the fence will be repainted hopefully soon. Um, the first bedroom here used to be my um, mum and dad's old bedroom. So I guess I should restate again that this used to be my family home. So it's been nine years, I've, yeah, nine, nine years roughly since I was last here. So it's very exciting for Chris and I to be able to move back in again. Anyway, on with the tour. So this used to be my mom and dad's room. Um, it's now a storage room. So this is one of the places that needs a lot of attention to <laughs> put things away and make it look a little bit more nice and orderly. But anyway, um, a lovely hallway. It used to be painted differently. So obviously when we moved out, a lot of things were changed. So this used to have this really nice like half blue so it was half blue and it was half like a i guess a cream yellow color kind of like a similar color to this but not quite but yeah and it looked really nice so that's all been painted this is um mine and chris's bedroom now but it used to be my childhood bedroom when i was really young so us kids used to all sleep in this one room so that was my bed used to be here this wardrobe was not here um but my bed used to be here and there was a bunk bed here and my brother Elliot used to my oldest brother slept on the top and Declan my twin brother slept on the bottom and there was a wardrobe here I'm just remembering something there was a wardrobe here and a little tv on top and I remember sitting on the top bunk with Declan when we were really young and Declan has always been a gamer and we I would watch him play like I think it was Sega or like Super Nintendo games something like that so really old games um up the top of the bunk so that's a little fun little memory for me but yes oh and when we because then we built the second story like not long after Brody was born and then this ended up becoming uh, Declan and Brody's bedroom. And then Declan was the top bunk. <laughs> uh, so this is the living room. As you can see, everything looks so bare right now because we don't have a lot of stuff. But at the moment, this is pretty much the bunny sanctuary. Because we have two buns, who are obviously not here right now. But we fence off this area like with baby gates and stuff. And we lay down all these blankets to protect the carpet. And this is just the bunny like area. So I still, you know, watch TV and stuff and play games. And Chris, this is Chris's desk, you know, but we also have the buns running around and, you know, having a bit of space. So that's cool. This is the kitchen. So it's very different from when we used to live here. This is all new. The tiles are new. The tabletops are new. Not table, uh, countertops, countertops. Cabinets all completely new. 
still got the cubby under the stairs though. I quite, I'm quite happy with that for some reason. I don't know, just fun little nostalgia, I suppose. But yeah, oh, that was broken when we moved in. So definitely people lived here before us. Um, yeah, so there's a few things that need fixing, like that wardrobe in, um, our bedroom actually partially doesn't work, so we're getting that fixed soon. But yeah, so this is the new kitchen, it's got these really cute little, little tiles here, the little, oh, there's two cow tiles, two cow tiles. Oh wait, are they? Are they the same? Yeah, sorry, I realized I haven't closely looked, but there's like a sheep and a chicken and very wholesome. <laughs> so yes. So this is also um, interesting about this. So this is the laundry room. And the major difference is there used to be a door here. Yeah. So they got rid of this door and this used to just be like where the toilet was. So you go through this door and there was a toilet. And then there was the bathroom. And that's where, you know, the tub and the basin were, and the laundry was too. The laundry used to be in here. So that's all changed around clearly. And the reason I realized, cause like, where'd the door go? Why did they, why did they do that? It's because they wanted to extend the kitchen. This is out like a little more, just a little more than it used to be. So they got rid of the toilet and they redid the bathroom. And this room, obviously, this was just like a sunroom kind of thing like a storage room. And yeah, so now it's a laundry. And now we got this brand new bathroom, which is like switched around too. Like the tub used to be over here, the basin used to be there, and da -da -da -da. <laughs> So it's, it's so cool in that, you know, I'm back, hi, in the house that I grew up, but because of these changes, it's surreal as well. Like it doesn't feel 100% like the place I grew up, obviously. Anyway, we'll go and check out ah, when I can open the door. Oh, bark, bark, bark. Ah, uh, the backyard. Okay. So here's the backyard. We mowed the grass yesterday. The major difference is that the hill's hoist line has been moved. It used to be, oh, I don't know, more like here. And now they've moved it over here, which I'm not a fan of personally, because it goes a little bit over the neighbor's fence and that's not very good. They also extended this gate so it's higher. So it used to be that, you know, it would stop here and, um, They've obviously just gotten rid of that and replaced it so it's much more private, I suppose. They even like put this part here, which wasn't here before. So they were, I don't know, I guess maybe they had stuff of value like motorbikes or something they didn't want people being able to see easily. We still got the old shed. Um, when we were young, we used to have our dad build us like a tree house thing that used to be here. And we had a trampoline. We always had a trampoline for forever. We used to have a swing set here when I was small and then we obviously got rid of it um, at a certain point because, you know, all the kids are too old for a swing set. There's the side of the house with lots of plants that, like, I think, you know, my mum planted or maybe just both my parents planted. And look how tall they've gotten. Oh my gosh, they were not that tall before. It's really like, whoa, you know, nine years of growth right there. Okay, let's keep going. So, let's go upstairs. Oh yeah, they changed the carpet too. It used to be this really nice blue carpet. No more, ugly carpet now, ugly carpet. And this used to be blue. The rails used to be blue and everything and I miss that. You can see actually a little bit of the blue. Zoomed in right here, see? Ooh. Come on, focus, camera. Here we go. So you can see the lovely blue it used to be. No more. <laughs> okay, let's keep going. Um, this used to be my brother Elliot's room. Oops, focus. Um, yes, when I was growing up. So this was his room and over there was my room. Um, but now it's uh, kind of a storage room and it will become a guest 
bedroom. That's the intention. Chris and I will get another bed. We'll pop it up here so then, you know, when people come over, they have a place to sleep. So, here's the upstairs bathroom, which is mostly unchanged, which is awesome, actually. Like, I miss the little, like, detail here <laughs> of the little horsey, seahorsey tiles. I actually miss that. I thought that was so cute. This is the upstairs living room, which I've just, at the moment, put my exercise stuff, my writing craft table over here for now. You know, so there's lots of area to work out and stuff, which is cool. But it used to be. Um, there used to be a TV unit here, and we play video games here. Like, I remember we had a poster of the game Morrowind from Elder Scrolls, because I loved Elder Scrolls, and it used to go here, so. <laughs> oh. And right here where the exercise stuff is, used to be the desk and the computer, which we had for ages. So that was a very popular spot in the house. Here's our awesome window. It was always had such a great view. I even got the original blinds still, which again, anything that is still here from when I used to live here just brings me so much joy, so much joy. So this was my uh, original bedroom you know, after I was eight. Uh, it was not this color, it was like a light pink color because, oh, uh, you know, I just, I do remember as a young kid being like, mm, I like pink, you know, pink's good. So, <laughs> I think I actually remember my parents trying to dissuade me from painting it pink because obviously as I grew older, it would seem rather childish and, you know, whatever. I mean, it was, but, <laughs> oh well. So now it's this kind of, uh, mom called, told me what color it was exactly. I've been calling it lavender, but it's not, it's, it's something else, whatever. Um, oh yeah, I've made my desk a standing desk for now because I only have one chair and I'd rather keep it to the, um, you know, uh, writing and craft table for now. Oh, I want to just quickly show off. So my studies have a lot of attention in terms of organizing stuff, but Check it out. So organized. Well, I need shoe. I don't know. I need some some better form of just stacking my shoes. But anyway, lots of organizing done there. And I was just very happy about that because it took a while. <laughs> and yeah. Oh my gosh, I think that's the whole house. That's awesome. So hopefully in the coming months, you know, things are going to be just even better like f there's things that need to be fixed in the house like I think I mentioned the wardrobe downstairs and like everything will get organized and we'll add more to the house and it'll just be so good <laughs> so yeah oh, so good I'm so happy I'm back it is really great and it's such a big house too and ah, it's so great I love it anyway thank you so much for listening this has been my um something of October 2019 tour and I'll do another one of these um, when I have more new things to show. All right, thank you.